This comes from Hor. Hor. <laughs> I apologize. Her. Uh, 1995 fifth studio album, Daydream. I don't think I've heard any Mariah Carey. (laughs) Sorry. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to more song reactions from my August submissions. Uh, Head on over to r slash Alex Heights if you would like to post good song or album reactions, submissions, suggestions. Anyway, continuing on with more of Z-Twig submissions. This is the Sweet Dub Mix of Fantasy by Mariah Carey. I don't think I've heard any other Mariah Carey song aside from uh, All I Want for Christmas is You. Um, This is her 1995 uh, album, Daydream, fifth studio album. Um, And it's the opening single here, I believe. Yes, fantasy. And uh, this is just a a random mix uh, among many um, that was done of this song. Haven't heard the original, but we're going going to go... With the sweet dub mix today. Um, starting off, you know, right out of the gate, just super strong. So, sw- uh, Maria Carey, Fantasy, Sweet Dub Mix, Official Audio, 1080p HD. Oh no. Oh no. We're gonna hear them boom, doom, boom, doom, boom, doom, 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 doom. Is this plastic love? It's everywhere. Destiny's Child girls. I know very little about R&B. Very little. Plastic love.
This sounds like the soundtrack to like a anime visual novel that would play during like a club or a dining restaurant. Oh, Ginky Disco. Ooh, ooh. Waltz, you sussy baka. Russian ain't kidding around. thing for the thumbnail. Like, uh, there. It sounds like the piano from like the uh, water levels in Super Mario 64. Okay, um, I want to go to this real quick and listen to the actual fantasy. Just out of curiosity. I have heard this song. <laughs> Wow, that's completely different. I didn't even recognize it. This played at work a ton, so there you go. Um, that's really funny, actually. Oh, man, okay. Um, I mean, um, 
I, I, I won't turn my nose up at that. Like, I, that's not anywhere near something that I, like, would say I enjoy. It, it's tough because, like, there's... There's like musical indifference and then musical like positivity, right? Where you listen to a song and you get like a positive feeling from it. I didn't necessarily get a positive feeling from that remix. Um, but at the same time, it like it, it doesn't create a negative feeling either. It just creates a feeling, if that makes sense. Um, and usually like that, that middle ground that's very small for me um, of certain genres or songs or artists even, um, it can be just a complete coin toss as to whether or not, um, I'd rather not listen to it or I wouldn't mind if it was on as far as musical indifference goes. Um, and this, I wouldn't mind. Like if this was playing somewhere, like I wouldn't be like, oh, this sucks. It'd just be like, oh, okay. Makes me think of visual novels and... (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> the water level from Super Mario 64. Anyway, that is all I have for you today at this moment in time. Thank you all so much for watching. Godspeed. <laughs>